Well, um, to apply the correct dose with the correct exposure parameter is extremely important for the quality of the provided images, in particular for all exams in the German, Swiss and Austrian region. As we all know, different exposure techniques have severe impact to the image impression for the radiologists and may lead to slightly different diagnosis. And getting automatically the correct and for the patient sufficient exposure parameters provide a high stability of image impression to the radiologist. So this is a saving of time for both, for the radio radiographer and the radiologist. While in countries like Austria or Germany, part of the image aesthetics and also part of the frequent charging of radiological authorities is the correct positioning of the X-ray object as it should be. A radiographer have to spend additional time on a workstation to adjust the image after the image acquisition to get the object into the requested orientation. And to get this automatically will save time in this automatic mode where radiographers can better focus on the patient. Having a patient positioning under control is a difficult item, I think. And in particular, when you have a trauma, an elderly or a mentally confused patient, Already on the way between the patient and the control room, a patient could have moved and if not immediately seen, it could impact the image quality, dose or even the correct position of the object. And having the ability to control on an easy way patient and his movements on displays on both on the overhead tube crane and on the workstation display is giving a better patient control, which finally results in better images, avoiding retakes due to patient's movements. And all these features um, helping to reduce patient's dose, retakes and improving the workflow. And it is more than welcome in a radiological environment.